I'm your Mason neighborhood reporter Hannah McElroy here at City Hall, where the city of Mason decided on Monday to discontinue their canine program in light of recent events. I admit I made a mistake and I apologize for it. This incident eventually led me being forced into resignation or terminated by the city manager. Mason officer and canine handler Hayden Wildfong resigned from the Mason Police Department in January. He was under investigation for removing and leaving his gun belt unattended while working out at Mason High School, which the city and district said violated numerous policies. There was a loaded weapon left unattended in the presence of students in our schools. I won't be the first to say that the negligence of City Manager Stewart and her insufficient policies have left this city on the brink of complete catastrophe. It's a fortunate case that the headlines we're reading in the media this week don't include dead children and teachers. The city of Mason said when Wild Fog resigned, the investigation ended and he was required to return his canine dog Tamarack because he signed a memorandum of understanding where Tamarack was listed as city property. Tam does not deserve this treatment for putting her life on the line for the community of Mason and the Tri-County area. Tam has been my partner for the last three years. We have spent every minute of every day together. She was part of my family. And after a vote Monday, it was decided that other law enforcement agencies will have the opportunity to add Tamarack to their force. That's not something we would do for business. And if she is not selected, the city will put Tamarack up for adoption. The city has done, I think, the right thing here and is pursuing the right course. I cannot support giving the dog to the officer at this stage. The decision came after they received no interest in the handler position from internal or external candidates. In Mason, I'm your neighborhood reporter, Hannah McElroy, Fox 47 News.